Hello and welcome to the Shared Nothing uh, Live Migration with Hyper-V. I'm Brian Lewis, I'm an IT Pro Evangelist with Microsoft, and today I'm going to show you a quick demonstration of moving a virtual machine without any shared storage. So I have a DOS box, and in this DOS box, if we look at it, the hard drive is located on the machine locally. So I'm going to select Move on this, move the virtual machine from one server Hyper-V2, the host, to another server. So I choose just move the machine. I need to go select where the files are located, and here I choose the D drive, the Hyper-V subfolder, you can choose any folder, and I choose next, and finish. What's going to happen here is, we're syncing first the data, the disks, and then we sync the RAM, and we move the machine. Notice it's no longer in Hyper-V2, it's now in Hyper-V1. We click on it, and here we have Duke Nukem continuing to play ran the whole time without interruption. So let's look at that again. Let's move it from Hyper-V1 back to Hyper-V2. Again, I click on the machine. I click Move. I go and I select that I'm going to move. Now that I move that data, I select I go want to go back to Hyper-V2. I select where I want it to place again. And notice this hard drive is different, a different setup. I choose a subdirectory on that local machine. Click Next, and Finalize, Finish. It's going to sync the data again and move the data. After it moves the data, it's going to sync the RAM, and then it ARPs to the switch and moves the machine all together. It's no longer on Hyper-V1, and it is over on Hyper-V2. If we click on it again, here it's up and running. So that's Shared Nothing Live Migration with Hyper-V. Hope you enjoyed it.